Hi, uh, just over a year ago, the Centre for Education and Research on Aging, with the support of the research office, purchased a tri-shaw. This tricycle built for two was designed by a Danish cyclist in an effort to allow people with mobility issues to continue to enjoy cycling. The seat for the pilot is behind the passengers to facilitate conversations and social connections. And now, just 12 years later, cycling without age is a global movement. UFB Trishaw Rides has been operating at the Chilliwack campus, where students take older adults for rides along the Vetter River trails. My research partner, Allison pritchard Orr, and I are currently conducting a study exploring the reciprocal benefits of Trishaw Rides for both pilots and passengers. While we're still analyzing the data, as might be expected, some findings confirm our assumptions, while other findings were more unexpected. As expected, passengers enjoy connecting with the student pilots. They describe the pilots as great, as good, and they really like hearing about their studies and their goals. Passengers also spoke about how much they enjoy being outside, being able to see changing colors of the, the leaves, feeling the wind, the rain, and seeing the mountains and the river. An unexpected finding has been the importance the passengers place on being seen riding in the tri shop. All of the passengers described how the people walking and cycling along the trail stop when the tri shell goes by and wave and call out to them. This underpins a critical need to remain included and to be seen as we age. They also talked about the uniqueness of the tri shell and their desire to do something different. A desire to do something different when days often lack variety. I think these early findings point to important understandings that recognize enduring motivations, diversity, and the importance of inclusion as we age. We recently applied for a CIHR grant with UBC and Lakehead to move the research to next steps, so more to come.